Hello, I am trying to start a YouTube video, and my main topic is probably going to be baseball. If you live in Texas and you live in Dallas, you might have seen this hat. Um, this is one of my favorite baseball hats. If I turn it around, I am number 50. I don't know if it is backwards for y'all or not. I'm number 50. That stands for Keller. Again, if it's correct for you, it might be like a backwards K. Um, so I'm not number five. I don't like that number. I mean, I don't care for it. Um, so I just got back from my vacation and I got a couple of baseballs to show my love and passion for baseball. I got one in New Mexico, one from the, um, the Petrified Forest, one from Arizona, and one from the Grand Canyon. So I just got back from the Grand Canyon, New Mexico, and all that stuff. So this is my um, Arizona baseball. This was one of my least favorite, followed behind my New Mexico baseball. New Mexico because these two, if you can tell on camera, they're pretty glossy and shiny. They do not feel like real baseball. And then the carving of them, like, sort of, is thick a little bit more. But these last two baseballs that I have in my hands are my favorite ones. This one says Grand Canyon. Grand Canyon on that one. And this one has petrified wood. I can show you some petrified wood in life in a second. So I have all this stuff. I got two hats. I got a Route 66 hat. And I got a Sedona hat. My mom grew up in Arizona, Sedona, Grand Canyon. And she grew up mainly around the Grand Canyon. I'm on Dallas, Texas, Keller. So I am not... I was born and raised here, so I hope you will love my YouTube channel. And like I said, I would get you some petrified wood. This stuff goes for like a ton of money. I got this money for pretty cheap though, so I'm lucky. So I just got my petrified wood. Now, if you ask me, well, dude. Is this even real wood? Yes, it, this piece of wood is probably about 20,000 years old. So it takes about five to 10,000 years to form. And I have three pieces. This one looks more like wood, as you can tell. So I have this piece. I am a first baseman. On our Paris vacation, I got this baseball. I didn't I forgot to show you that one. I might as well show you my Texas Ranger baseball. I just got this one at Walmart. Nothing big about this one. But I got all these baseballs from States. So these baseballs are pretty special. And then I am an all star. Um, I'm trying out for a late this season. This is my all-star ring. My rec all-star ring. Because I'm like an all-star. But I'm also in rec. So I'm not like a select all-star player. Um, my passion for baseball started like a couple of seasons ago. I'm pretty much a power hitter on my team. But I don't use my hips. And I wait till my advantage too much. I just swing with my arms, but I still do pretty good at that. Um, sorry if this video is pretty horrible. I'm looking down at my face instead of the dot up here where I'm supposed to be looking at. I'll try to keep my eyes on that. So my hat, I'm very, very, very proud of. Um, this is like, I've been running this hat for my entire life pretty much. 
Um, my dad got me this horrible haircut. It was way shorter, and then we decided to cut it. Anyways, I'm not that big into Avengers, as you can tell, not a shirt. I just have it, you know? Why not use it? I am pretty big in knives. I love knives. You might be wondering, well, dude, it's not even a real knife. Do you even have any real knives? I do. They are up here. Got one right here. When there's a real knife, it's actually sharp, but we'll cut you. I got my old timer. And I got. We go to call it, we go to it multiple states. So this one I got from Pikes Peak, Colorado, and it said that the elevation is 4,115 feet. It says that in this little box right here. Don't know if you can see that though. Okay, and it has all these. It's a gift shop now, so it's pretty much just junk. Um, but this knife over here, my Swiss Army knife, it's right here. It's pretty nice. Dad said if I keep up this one until my next birthday, I will get another one and another one and another one. I just have to have it all together. I have my last and final knife. Actually, this isn't my final knife. I just don't know where one of them is. And the lens are going off, so I should probably end this video pretty soon. But it's not a little warm, so we're good. I have my cold steel knife. This is probably my most favorite. Again, this is actually sharp. You can see the shine on it. So, the sheath. It's pretty hard to pull out. Like, whenever I come up, turn it down a little bit. I have to, like, come to my waist. Like, right here. Like, because whenever it's on a belt, you know? I'm gonna try to show y'all that in a second or later. So, I, like, literally, I'm on my like, you know, it like that. I'm like, it's pretty stiff. It's like, yeah. It's not the way I've been using it. It is how I made it. Or how I made it. <laughs> how we bought it. Um, I love baseball. As you can tell, I have all this baseball stuff. I also have another big a pretty big passion for my fish. I have a ton of fish. I used to have one, two, six, seven, eight, nine, I used to have eight fish. Now I have two fish. Um, sadly, one of them died on my vacation. And then because my I had to put a weekend feeder in there, so that guy died. And then I didn't tell y'all. But this knife over here, the first knife I showed y'all, right, or the second knife I showed you that I did this with. Also, I got from the Grand Canyon, and then it says Route 66. I have a Route 66 hat, but I don't feel like getting it right now. I mean, I'll show you it. It's like right there somewhere in that pile of hats. If y'all worry about this, I guess I can show y'all a little bit. Here's my Sedona hat. Arizona on the back. I got 66 hat. So it's about 66 on the back. And it says this over here. And then it has that again. So those are pretty much my two favorite hats. I again love baseball. I love knives. And I also might have a gun video. Um, because I also like guns. But it's possible I could make that today. Most likely not. But I'll see y'all later on our next vlog. Bye. Bye.